coming up above the table. 20 years. Somebody help me. 20. 20. All right. Amen. <laughs> amen. We thank God for that. Amen. It's a blessing for a pastor. Amen. In spite of how many people that's in their congregation, it's a blessing for them to stay there. Amen. amen. Many days they can just leave and that's it. Amen. You don't see them missing out, missing out of action. You don't know where they They took off and left town. Amen. But to stay there, and I remember part of the story that they were the only two members when they first started off. And they were staying there in the church. And they could have easily given and said, okay, come on, we live in Lexington. What are we doing? But amen, we thank God that he heard from the Lord. Amen. Because the Lord sent him people. Amen. 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 I don't know what people say when they talk about their pastors and there's nobody there but them. Who are you pastoring? Amen. But we thank God for that, how they held on. Amen. That the Lord sent, you know, who he was going to send to their being. Amen. I thank God also for this man personally. He is my cousin. Amen. My first cousin. Amen. I thank God for him. Besides my bishop, I thank God for him. Because they have truly, him and Bishop Raymond Walsh have truly stepped up to the plate since my mom been gone. Amen. And I mean stepped up to the plate. Amen. Amen. And they're there when I need them. Amen. I can call them. One day I was really having a bad day and I was sitting in Walmart. It got me that bad. And I was sitting on the bench. 